Hello and welcome back to Bits and Bobs. Today's video is all about the 1963 penny, the coin we see on screen now. Firstly in the video I'll talk to you about the design of the coin on both obverse and reverse, and then we'll move on to the facts and figures of the coin. The design features the iconic Lady Britannia, seated with the shield to her side, holding the trident in the air, and wearing her helmet and drapes. This is the portrait of her done by Leonard Charles Wyan, and adorned the one pence piece from 1860 to 1970 a long-running design. Behind her can be seen to the left a lighthouse, and the words one penny either side giving the denomination, as well as the date, in this case 1963, below her at the bottom of the coin. There is also beading or teeth around the design to deter from the coin being clipped, especially this is important as the coin features a plain rim or no reading on the edge of the coin, so those beads are more important. Now then, as you've seen we've flipped over the coin to see the obverse of the coin, where we can see the portrait of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. This is her first portrait, done by Mary Gillick, and features the Queen facing to the right, wearing no crown, but with her hair up and a laureate in her hair. The legend around her reads Elizabeth II de Gratia Regina F.D. This is in Latin, and in some parts abbreviated Latin, and translates to English as Elizabeth II, by the grace of God, defender of the faith, her titles as monarch. Once again, as with the reverse, the coin features beading or teeth around the rim of the coin, to once again deter from clipping on both sides. Now then, we will move on to the facts and figures of the 1963 penny. The coin was minted at the Tower Hill Mint in London, where the Royal Mint was based between 1810 and 1975. The coin is composed of 97% copper, 2.5% zinc, and 0.5% tin, so it is a bronze alloy, although majority copper. The weight of this coin is 9.6 grams, so it's fairly heavy, compared to others at the time, and has a diameter of 30.8 millimetres, so once again is a fairly large coin compared to others circulating at the time. The mintage of this coin is 125,235,600, and so is an immensely common date, very easy to find. A penny was of course worth one pence, and that was one twelfth of a shilling, or one two hundred and fortieth of a pound sterling back at the day, and back in 1963 when the coin was made, one penny was equal to 11 pence today, so not much, but still a bit more of a buying power than a penny would be today. The coin was finally demonetized on the 14th of February 1971, as the new pennies were introduced with decimalization taking place that day as well. Now then, after all these years, what is the value of a 1963 penny? In poor condition it will sell for around 99p, fine, £1.30, extremely fine, three pounds, and even in uncirculated, only seven pounds. So a very cheap and affordable coin, due to the incredibly high mintage figure, but a great design still, and a cool coin to pick up for a nice low price to get one in good condition. So there we go, the 1963 penny. Please do subscribe if you have one of these coins, and if you enjoyed watching this video. And of course, a big thank you to everyone for watching, we hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you again soon for more coins on the Bits and Bobs channel. Bye.